My name is Jim Estes, and today I'm going to talk about a drill that I think is extremely important for the swing plane. So what I want you to do is, and this, by the way, is going to give you an instant understanding of exactly the feeling you want to have in the golf swing. Take a club. You can put a rod, alignment rod, in the grip, or I'm sorry, in the butt end of the golf club. Take the golf club, turn it like you're going to hold it, and then what I want you to do is take that club, put it right against your left hip, so you're holding both clubs here. Now you've got an alignment rod on the ground and a golf ball. And what I want you to do, getting into your good posture position, your weight over the arches, getting feel balanced. The insides of the heels are going to be about the width of your hips. Take a swing back, slow motion, and trace with that alignment rod the target line all the way up. The shaft should be parallel to your target line at the top. And then slowly coming down, trace the line. And do this in slow motion. Right into the impact position. So this is a great feedback tool, visual feedback tool, for learning the proper swing plane. Go right to your impact position. I encourage you to do this drill in slow motion. And if you have five minutes a day, if you do this drill every day, I guarantee you're going to improve your golf swing. So again, I think you'll find this to be extremely helpful. JimEstesGolf.com if you have any questions. This is better. We're almost at right angles. That's pretty good. <clears throat> Let's see. Your head's much better. On the back swing, you remember how you went forward just toward the ball a little this way. Mm -hmm. That's That's pretty good show. Well, I wouldn't worry about that. We got a the more you're to the, you're on the see the camera right now is more on your on your target line, so it appears that the shaft is coming in. The more you move the camera to the right, the more the shaft's going to appear more from the inside. If I move the camera to the left on your hand line, it wouldn't look that way. That's why I cam That's why I like 3D better because video is very deceiving. <laughs> Depending on where you put the camera, like that looks right from the inside. But if we move the camera this way, it will look right down the line. So you're saying that's pretty good? Yeah, no. that's not bad. And I'll show you your path to face relationship on the flight scope and you'll see why. It's just the head position, you know, that's the thing. That's the thing you gotta work on. I mean that's that's the only thing from this angle. So <coughs> too much movement toward the ball there. That's all. That's all. I mean you're still hitting it well, but my preference would be to be maybe two inches toward where you rigid so this the bill of your cap like I don't want it to cross that line if I if I went <clears throat> like this I want your head to stay in that corridor it can go down some I don't want it to get outside that corridor because then you run the risk of having to compensate and hit it on the heel um, so other than that I, I The club face is good position there. Yeah, I I, I like it. Um, 